Hey my loves and welcome back to another video and it's your girl Miranda Lee if you're new make sure you hit that subscribe button right there click it and the bell next to it to get notified every time I upload to my channel I do multiple things guys and girls I do Hunting the Unseen, which is Paranormal Investigations, my Make Me Up series, All Things Beauty, skincare, just anything beauty-wise, reviews, tutorials, etc. And my Vlogulator, which is vlogging my daily life. But today is starting a special little mini series and I'm going to tell you all about it and what I'm going to be doing <clears throat> so yeah if you have not subscribed yet I'm going to give you all a couple of minutes and Okay, y'all should be subscribed and had hit the bell already and commented down below. That way you can get a post notification shout out at the end of one of my videos. And just to show love, give this video, you know, thumbs up. And yeah, let's get into this video so I can tell you more about what I'm going to be doing. <sighs> Tell them like, share, and subscribe. Hit the subscribe. Go ahead, go for it. Okay, so I am going to be telling you guys, as you can probably tell by the title, I am going to be doing a little mini series, part series, so it'll be like a three part series, little mini three part series, um, and it's all about, you know, losing weight you know before all of the COVID stuff happened I you know was working going to the gym working out toning up your girl was getting fit and I was feeling good and then she came along and ruined everything she destroyed everything um so I've been home and my weight has always kind of fluctuated. I've always, especially with like my height, um, they always had told me I was a little, you know, overweight, whatever, whatever. But I, I love being, you know, I'm thick. It, it is what it is. Um, and most of my thickness is muscle. So like from my legs, let me show you guys. So, like, my legs and everything, th guys, this is all muscle, okay? This is what your girl is going to be working on. Um, and then, of course, my arms. So, I'm just going to be toning up my arms and my legs and glutes and everything. But, I was doing research and I was like, hmm, let me start a little mini series and do like a 30 day, you know, journey. You know, what I eat, my workouts, things like that. Until I came across the Chloe Ting two week challenge. Yes. So she has, she is a famous 
um, fitness YouTuber. I will leave her link and everything in the description and what she does. She has like this whole routine and um, meal plannings and stuff like that. And a part of losing weight is food proportion, exercise, and just cutting back on those sugars and carbs, you know? Um, so since January, I have stopped eating meat. I eat like um, baked chicken and, you know, like fish. So I'm kind of like a, so I'm kind of like a pescatarian, but also eat a little bit of chicken <laughs> in my diet um, as like my protein. But with this whole workout in this little series, um, I am going to be changing it up a little bit. So you will see it. I will be documenting everything and today's video is just kind of showing you my first workout which isn't going to be a part of the Chloe Ting challenge um, but it is something that I had researched and was like what can I do before I found out about the challenge to kind of burn my belly fat and lose, you know, some of that just like bloat and water weight and yeah, so I came across a way on how to do it and it worked for a lot of people and for like 5% it didn't work. Um, so I am going to show you what I'm going to be doing and my little workout for today and then like I said it's going to be like a little mini series so like a three part or even if it's four part um just my little journey so I am going to have before and then after the end result um so yeah let me show you before and then what we're going to do and then start the whole I guess workout process so yeah let me show you guys what I found what I'm going to do and then my first little workout okay so as you can see um, I'll put it right here I have always been a dancer, so I've always been fit, I've always been toned, and I've always been able, like my metabolism has always been fast. Um, even after I had Adrian, I was still pretty small, I would say around like 150, I'm all, I was usually always around 150, 160, just because I was a dancer. I had a lot of muscle and don't think if you're working out that you're not losing the fat or you're not losing weight because you're gaining muscle and that's you know that's way better you don't want to lose weight and not have any muscle um so doing workouts while taking um, in like the proteins and things like that is a really really big deal so I am going to you know in the series show you what I make to eat for breakfast lunch dinners my snacks things like that just in today's video it's going to be what I had came across I'm going to try and see if this works for me do a workout and let me just explain to you so what it is is if you haven't heard or have already seen 
um, is the Vix Rub. I got this one. You can get this at the dollar store, um, or you can get like, you know, any type of Vix Rub will work. Um, and then the plastic wrap. Now, I have already ordered um, my little fitness trainer. That way I can do it put my fitness trainer over my wrap. I'm just waiting for it to come in. I literally just ordered it, so it should be in any day now. Um, so I made an alternative out of a pair of old, like, little sweatpant things and made it into, like, a wrap. Because the plastic wrap, if you don't have something to secure it, it will start to, like, you know, um, fold down and stuff like that. So I'm going to be wearing this for at least, or I'm going to try wearing this for at least six to eight hours. Um, I think six, and this is including my workout just to get a feel for it and let you guys know if there was any results because supposedly the first time you wear it um, and I seen a lot of people wearing it and actually going to sleep and waking up and they already lost like three inches like you could see a difference but you know you don't know everybody's body is different their metabolism is different and so this is what I'm going to try today to start off the series and I hope y'all like it and just keep watching so we can see the end result once I take this off. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on, fast forward through it so you can see me putting it on and everything and yeah, let's get into it guys.
Okay guys, so as you can tell, I got it on and I got it to where everything's kind of like holding everything in place until my shrink waist, my little waist trainer comes in, which I can't wait because this, putting this on was a hassle. Um, so it looks like this so far. And I just wrapped, you know, the little sweats, they don't fit me no more, around. And, oh my god, my arms are all hurting. Well, my shoulder, I've been having problems with it. But, okay, so we got it on. And we are going to wear it for six hours. And I'm just going to kind of do, like, my normal duties around the house. And then we are going to do a workout. Um, now, let me just tell you guys something. Let me put this up real quick. My stomach, oh, sorry guys. My stomach and everything, it's weird because it's like tingling, which kind of feels good in a way, but it's also kind of like burning a little bit. So it's like a tingle burn. It almost reminds me of like Icy Hot. Um, but it's weird. So it just started happening as soon as I finished up, you know, wrapping myself. And um, it was very hard to do alone. I'll probably have Alex help me the next time. Just being able to wrap it around myself and get it tight enough. But... For the first time, you know, I think I did a pretty good job. It's so weird. Like, the burning, tingling, cooling, it, it's weird. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to go. I got to go to the store, run a couple of errands, go to my P.O. box. And then we're going to do some workouts to get that sweat going to uh, um, really you know, get this activated and seeing if it works. Um, and then we'll see how it looks after six hours. So right now, I believe it is, let me check and see what time it is. Okay, so it's perfect. It's 1.30, so six hours from now, it's 1.30 p.m., so six hours from now, you know, and I'll do little check-ins. So right now, I still feel the burning, cooling, tingling sensation going on, but we really want to work up a sweat, you know, to like get it, get it going. Um, and then whenever my package arrives that I got for my workout, um, it's like this cream stuff and my waist trainer and... Y'all will have to see. I'll do a video when I get it. Um, and it'll be included in this little mini-series. So, so far, if y'all are liking this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Show some love. And, yeah. I gotta go to the store and do a couple of things. So, I'll probably bring y'all with me. Just so I can do some check-ins. And then we'll do our workout. So... Let's go. Okay, guys. So, um, I've been doing a little bit of chores and stuff around the house. And it has been, since I put this on, um, about two and a half hours. Because it is... 3.55 um so two and a half hours the tingling burning little sensation has subsided but I still kind of feel it and it's been shifting a little bit like when I sit down or pretty much when I sit down and get up it'll like kind of like move around a little bit but not too much to where I've really had to adjust it. I really haven't. 
Um, it's so in place. So we are still going to do our workout. I just, you know, um, did some stuff around the house. Uh, Adrian woke up, so I fed him his little snack and yeah. So I was just doing a check in to let you guys know how this is all going on. This is like the little thing, but I really can't wait for my waist trainer to come in. Fingers crossed. It comes in soon. Um, so other than that, um, hopefully the next clip will be my workout. Okay guys, um, I'm doing another check-in, it's been about another hour and a half, so we're hitting that halfway mark, and I just kind of took like a little break, I'm lying down, that way, you know, it can like absorb and kind of just, you know, do its thing, um, but, yeah, I just want to do a check-in, and, yeah, taking a little break, and then I'm going to do my workouts, and I'll record that, of course, so, I just wanted to keep y'all updated, and let's continue the video. Okay guys, so I'm about to go and do my laps. I have my pods, I'm gonna pop in. So um, I'll try and record a lap, um, and my reward, <laughs> I'm going to leave my water here, and then do four laps around my block, and each time I come here, grab some water, and then do my other lap, um, I've already stretched, um, it's very important. Whenever you're working out, stretch first, guys. You do not want to pull anything. And, yeah, hopefully this will build up some sweat. And that's why I'm wearing, you know, extra clothing to also produce more sweat. And then when I get back, I'm going to do a couple of little workouts here. And I'll record that. But... I'm about to start, um, oh, I'm like stretching out my leg. I'm about to start running. And when I was at the gym, I had actually got up to 13, no, 12, it was 14, 13. Um, minutes to a mile so I was getting pretty good I used to take like 30 minutes to do the mile and I got myself down to about 12 minutes um, and then like I said all this happened and I stopped working out so yeah I'm pretty excited for the end result of this today and then we're going to continue the whole journey of my little weight loss. Um, so yeah, I'm about to pop these in and go for a run. And I can do a check-in when I stop taking water. Alright, let's go. Oh gosh. It's been a minute since I worked out. So 
So what I'm doing is I'm running a block and then walking and then running a block and then walking until I can get my stamina back up. my god so let me fix y'all up without y'all falling so let me tell y'all your girl just ran a mile I did some walking. I ain't gonna lie to you. It was 30 minutes, but trust me, I will get back down to 12 to 14. Oh, child, I'm so hot and sweaty. Like, can y'all see? Like, seriously, the sweat dripping off of me. This, this ain't no joke, guys. This ain't no joke. Like. I'm hot than a bitch. Okay. So. I did the thing. And then I went outside. Guys. And this is just to... Like, demonstrate the whole Vix plastic stuff. Oh, my Lord Jesus, guys. Okay. Like, I'm ready for this two week. Uh,. Sorry, guys. I'm hot. Can y'all tell that I'm redder than usual? Your girl is hot. Like, hot. <sighs> okay. So, I've had this on for six and a half hours because I waited until... 5.30 to do the uh, run and a little workout. Girl, guy, my loves, let me tell you, after I ran and I did some uh, lunges, like I ran, and then on my last lap, I did lunges and then like the you know the kick the high knee type thing on my last lap I can't even talk because I'm so hot and I just feel like passing out like this shit is raw <laughs> right here oh man this is gonna be a journey mini series let me tell you okay let's just hope it gets better but anyways so I feel like I'm about to like pass out. I feel sweat dripping down my back, down my chest, <laughs> my face, like even on my stomach, which is kind of weird. So let's see if this thing actually worked and I'm gonna hop in the shower as well but see I also want to tone out my arms too but see this is easy like I can tone my arms out the camera always makes you look like 50 times fatter than you usually are and when I say fat I mean PHAT 
because your girl is, you know, but guys, it is so hot. And it's hot out here in Texas. Did I mention that? Like, anyways, all right, so <clears throat> I got my scissors because I'm ready to take this thing off and let's just see if it made a difference in my stomach area so let your girl calm down for a second and then we're gonna reveal oh my god that feels so much better to get off and I'm just gonna pull it down I really want y'all to like see So it did roll up a little bit, which, I mean, ah, oh, my scissors just fell. That's okay, you know. Um, it ain't going to change the fact that I still put Vicks right there and I had something over it. Let me grab my scissors. Oh. Okay. Are y'all ready? Because I am. And it's crazy because it's not even tight anymore. That's crazy. Can y'all see the sweat dripping? Ew, and this is all sweaty. Guys, okay. <laughs> Let me show you something. I know this might be gross. I'm going to turn you guys around. Hold on. Okay, so this is from my standpoint of view. And look at all of that sweat. Just like, look at that. Can y'all see that? That sweat pile. Oh my gosh, guys. Like... This is from my point of view. Just so y'all can get a closer look. And you can smell. I got the lavender vix, so it's not as minty. But look at that. And then when I went to like pull it, there was like a puddle of sweat. Y'all see that? Tell me y'all see that. Okay, so I'm gonna continue taking this off. Cause it ain't that easy to rip. Ugh. Did you just see all that sweat just fall? Oh my gosh. Guys. Like this thing is dripping in sweat. I know y'all see that. <laughs> Ew. Uh. Okay. So I'm just gonna like toss this to the side. And then have to wash my hands. But this is not me sucking in. So I do feel like there is a difference. Like I feel like for some reason right here is a little more defined. Or am I just tripping? Am I delusional? So like that's like that's me sucking out. I'm like, look at that. Okay. Now I still have, you know, my little line. But I feel like my stomach has gotten a little flatter. Now, like I said, I don't feel like this and, you know, this is still there. Um, but as far as, like, my stomach-wise, I feel like it has gotten a little flatter. Um, let me take this stupid thing off, cause it's... Okay, so I took, so I took this off, which I need to wash, but as far as them rolls, they're still there, they didn't say bye, but 
you know, like I said, I do feel like, you know, my stomach is a little flatter. And, um, I don't know. Y'all would have to, like, we would have to, you know, see more into it. Um, I am going to, um, wipe this off. And... Then this is where we begin our rest of our journey. <laughs> I just wanted to test the little plastic wrap thing. And, um, I don't know. I think it is useful to use right when you use it. Um, but then again, I don't know. Um, it made my skin feel very soft <laughs> and I mean I feel like maybe I might have lost like an inch or two um, next time I will like after this I will go buy like a little measuring tape thing so we can measure my waist and everything and we can see the progress as we go through this little mini series and I ain't trying to lose crazy amount of pounds, guys. I probably want to lose like 10, 12 pounds and really just tone up my arms, my legs, and my stomach. That's it. You know, I just want to tone up. I really don't want to lose weight. I want to tone. But I do got to lose a little bit of, you know, fat in the areas where I can't deny there is some extra fat. Um... But, I mean, overall, today was fun, and it feels good, so good, like, I feel so good to work out again, and to start, you know, this journey with you guys. It's something that we can do together, you know? And as well, I'll leave um, Chloe Ting's information in the description. Um, but I probably won't tag her in this yet. Or I probably will because, I mean, the whole thing is going to be about the challenge. Um, this was just, you know, my first day trying to get back into it and... Like I said, I think this will help us as a family, as a community to, uh, you know, get into shape together. And it kind of clears your head while you're out there. And, excuse me, like I was just going around my block to kind of like just listen to music and drown everything else out just for that little time. And, you know, you feel good afterwards. I mean, right now I feel like, excuse me, I could pass out. <laughs> like, if I take one step forward, I will fall over. Um, but it's literally been since the beginning of this year. Since I've worked out. Because when I started working, I just couldn't work out anymore. And because I was working so many hours. And then with this and us being quarantined, everything was crazy. So I'm going to... I'll do another check-in before um, I close out this video today. And tell y'all what I'm... Or show y'all what I'm going to eat for dinner. Right now, um, I'm just going to have some apples as a snack with some caramel. Just a little portion of caramel. I know, cut the, sh the sugars out. But just a little bit. I'm going to have a little snack. Rest for a second. And then I will see y'all in a few. So, <sighs> we can do this, guys. Together. All of us, not just me, but myself, right?
Right. Alright, I'll see you in a few. Okay, guys, so I fell asleep. I passed out. <laughs> I was so drained. I completely finished my full, what is it, like 30 ounce bottle of core water plus another of our miniature life waters. And once I hit the bed, your girl was your girl was gone. Like I was in exercise coma. Like I was on cloud twenty. That bed never felt so good in my life. I had to rejuvenate and whew, let me tell you. Day one kicked my butt. <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie. But there's still more to come. So again, make sure if you want to follow me on this journey, this mini series that I'm doing, um, make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you hit the bell and comment to show love, to let me know that you joined the uh, Lear Squad notification gang. I'm still so delusional, guys, <laughs> um, and exhausted. Um, so I'm fixing to hop in the shower, get ready for bed, all that good stuff. But I do have to do my post notification shout out. And the post notification shout out for today is Harper's Journey. So thank you, love, for being a part of the family, the Lear Squad, the notification gang, and just for showing love. Again, without you guys none of this would be possible and every day I'm so thankful and grateful and blessed to even have a thousand subscribers you know and I know we can make it to 5,000 I have faith in this so make sure you comment like share and subscribe and tell your cousins your moms your aunts your uncles your nieces your nephews to come subscribe and join the family as well um so without further ado i'm about to get in the shower clean up and probably get back into bed other than that guys i love you and oh, stay tuned for the next one and we will be starting um, Chloe Ting's Chili Challenge. So.